Now there's a few different ways of scrambling eggs. You can do it really quickly in a frying pan or you can do it the low and slow way in a pot. And I was taught this in the hotels when they're doing a big batch of scrambled eggs. I love doing it this way because they become really fluffy and light and of course very creamy. So I'm going to do four eggs. We're going to crack the whole egg straight into a pot. And of course, when you're doing this, use the best quality, freshest free range eggs you can get your hands on. Now that that's in there, I like to add a little bit of butter, about 15 to 20 grams that I'll break up. And now what I'll do is turn the heat on, the smallest burner is best, and then using a wooden spoon, break up the eggs, and then start to constantly stir until the curds start to form and start sticking to the side of the pan. Constantly stirring this is key, so keep an eye on it, don't walk away, and you'll see fluffy light scramble eggs start to form within a few minutes. Okay, now you can see how the scrambled eggs have formed. They're really light and creamy, but to make it extra creamy, I like to add just a small amount of cream, about a teaspoon or two, and then a little pinch of salt, and then turn the heat off, and then give that one final stir, and then that's it. Creamy scrambled eggs, perfectly cooked, and I'm going to pop this on a plate with my favourite side with scrambled eggs, some smoked salmon, and a little bit of toast. I'm gonna have a taste of this. Mmm, so creamy, so silky, yummo.